All right, thanks again for the fill, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. Breakaway, PYT16, those are your teams. Before we get started, we gotta do this random. Good luck to everybody. It was a sick uh, random, discounted. Uh, unfortunately, there's only seven teams left. So three people will not get spots. One person will get whales, that won't be good, but at least the top six will do all right. Anyway, uh, we're gonna do that random now. So good luck, good luck to everybody. Top seven get in, bottom three get break credit, $20 each. All right, so we're gonna roll the dice, we re-roll snake eyes. We're going six times. Six times, good luck everybody. Top seven get in, we're going six times. All right, good luck. One, two, we're going six times, three, Four, five, sixth and final, six. Boom, Kyle, congrats, down to Brom. Sorry, Mark, sorry, Alex Garcia, sorry, John. That sucks. Who was it? Mark had two spots, so at least he got one big spot out of it. All right, so let me type these names in. Uh, Kyle. Kyle, you got the Ronaldo Bruno spot. Congrats. Mark, good luck. Congrats. You got the Gavi spot. Abdul, congrats. You got Germany. Uh, Angelo, congrats. You got the Vinny Jr. All right, uh, Audre, congrats there. You came out a little bit ahead. You got the Pedri Fati spot. Stefan, you got England Beckham. You just about broke even on that. Maybe a little 10 bucks under or something like that. Brom, sorry, you get uh, Wales. And all right, let me send this break credit over, sorry guys, to Mark, Jaje, Alex, Garcia, and John. You guys each get $20 break credit. I'm gonna do that right now before I forget. Mark, uh, 20 bucks going to your Gmail account. Make sure I get the correct Alex Garcia because there are many. Uh, Alex Garcia live.com. All right, Alex, you got your gift card sent to live.com account. And John Demopoulos. John, $20 gift card sent to your Hotmail email. Anyway, sorry to the three of you that didn't make it. do this. Good luck to everybody.
Good luck of luck, guys. Let's get this going. Let's do a breakaway break. I think, uh, not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure I think Austin's coming back on tomorrow. It's Wednesday. I think he usually... Pretty sure he's coming on tomorrow. So we'll see how things go. If Austin goes on tomorrow, I may take tomorrow off and come back on Thursday, but we'll see. Unless it just depends on how much uh, Austin can fill. Good luck, everybody. Let's do this. Morocco, Canada, silver. Van Dyke, silver. Jonathan David. Belgium, yeah, uh, Belgium. Logo card. We got our first red. Good luck. Iran, Bayron Band. Got Iran in this one. Cyrus Siraj has Iran. I can't believe it. Rigged. I don't remember if I had him. I got him. Red is number to ninety nine. Lukic and Huang. Connections, Uruguay, Bruno Fernandes. Kane, Lucas Fernandez, Lukaku, Portugal, I got a blue, good luck, Serge Nabri. Germany, two of 49, two of 49. Germany was in the filler, Abdul. Kingsley Kuman, France, and Saar.
Ecuador and the Brazil logo. Got a red coming up. We got a Gavi. Ooh, and a nice Kai Havertz red, Germany. Gonna be rookie. Kai Havertz two ninety nine. Twenty three and nine. Kitelare, Belgium, Vlakovic. Connections Germany, Connections USA, Busio and Pepe. Drupal Moting. And France Diaby. Connections Foden and Mount Qatar. We got a purple. Good luck. Lotaro Martinez. Purple. Valverde. Two of thirty five for Uruguay. So, how are we all doing tonight? I hope everybody's doing well. Produce and Saka. Got New Era, Mexico, and Kovacic. Mm, got a autograph. Burdisso, Burdisso autograph. Connections, Serbia and Caustic. Julian Alvarez, nice. Salik, England. Sandro and Danilo, Alfonso Davies, hey Luke what's going on brother, how are you man, where are you at, you in Germany still or are you back in the, Alfonso Davies, boom diddy, 
to 49. Canada. Sexiness there. Then back to the UK. Nice. Where are you at in Germany? Frankfurt? Thorsten's way? Where, where is Helga? Helga's in Stuttgart? I think he said her. Who's in Stuttgart? Someone's in Stuttgart. I usually used to go to Stuttgart when I go to Germany. So, Alfonso Davies and Coutinho. Frankie de Young, Malin. Oh, nice. Stuttgart hanging out at Königstrasse in Stuttgart. Remember back in the day, Stuttgart was my stomping grounds in the 80s. Barely getting started, Kyle. There's 20 boxes in the break, so we're on box three out of 20. All those boxes you see up there still gotta go. Yeah, it's a long break, it's 20 box break. That's right, back in the 80s. Back in the day. Connections. How about Frankie de Young to Connections, Busquets and Koke, the Rami rookie to 99 for Denmark. Kim, Rodri. Pino and uh, Silver Mori from this Mori. Partey and Cappy. I think realistically, guys, we're probably going to call it a night after this. I don't think that 50 is, is going, and it's late, and I want to get to sleep too late. I want to be able to get up and watch the game, and then i got a doctor's appointment too, so I think we'll uh, call it a night after this. we got a gold coming up. Good luck. Rafinha and the gold. Who's it going to be? Onana, Cameroon, and I've been saying France the whole time, uh, so I guess I'll stick with France, but um, 
I don't know, kind of like Argentina's chances right about now. Argentina's playing really well. But, I mean, I would like Messi to, uh, from a sentimental standpoint, I would like to see Messi win. He's had such an amazing career, and to put a World Cup title on it, that would uh, be the uh, icing on the cake for all those that maybe rest in soul for all the criticism he got from Maradona and the others for never winning the big games. Here's his chance. Pedri. Yeah, they do look really good. For Argentina at this point. France won it last time. Let Messi have his uh, cup. I know, man. Julian Alvarez is a beast. Man, his values are going to start uh, hitting the stratosphere here. Boom, did he? Coutinho. Is that another one of these doubles? Yeah, we got a double. Paul Pogba. Nice. Sometimes they stick together like that. I mean, it's going to be a toss-up no matter what, but certainly argument could be made. I mean, one of the arguments for Ronaldo was that Ronaldo always played bigger in tournaments. I mean, Ronaldo did more with Portugal with less behind them than Messi did in the past. But then, you know, Messi's really uh, turned it up. I, I, I don't... I mean, you can make the argument, but it's still going to be... The Ronaldo guys are going to be on Ronaldo bandwagon and Messi on Messi. <clears throat> it's been pretty amazing when we've seen two of the greatest of all time at the same time so recently yes recently yes but I mean if you look at what Ronaldo did with Portugal the Euros and then he with less support but I agree. I mean, for the last two, three years, it's not really close. For the last two, three years, Messi's been, uh, been better. Yeah. No, I mean, currently, there's no comparison between the two of them, I don't think, anymore. At this stage in their career, Messi is better. But if you look over the entire career, I don't know. I, I mean, I personally prefer Messi just because I always thought mostly because of the attitude that Ronaldo had and his inflated ego. Yeah, did you see that today where he just kind of like made the guy, Guardiola was like, oops. And Guardiola is having an amazing tournament too. Onana again. Just kind of left him in the dust. That goal was pretty. The second goal was pretty too, man. Alvarez just took the ball at like that was almost Maradona esque. I mean, he did get lucky at the end where the ball bounced, but he basically took the ball at midfield and just dribbled his way and scored. Lukaku. Tar. Saka.
Wow, you got to go? That's awesome. You going to the final, Abdul, or no? You got tickets to the final? You got to go to now. If you've been to the quarters and the semis, you got to go to the final. It's going to be like an epic final, too. If it's Argentina, France, it's going to be like one of the epic finals of uh, all time, I think. Because like last final, France, Croatia, it's kind of like, ah, whatever. You know, and the other ones, I don't know, like, you know, but this one to me, it's like, not very often where the top two teams clearly make the final. And if France makes it, Argentina and France are by far the best two teams. Forty percent on sale. While traveling back to UAE, oh well. Still got to watch some amazing stuff. Morocco winning it all. Imagine, imagine if that happened. Oh my God. That would be the, one of the greatest upsets of all time. And I'm telling you, it's not that far-fetched for Morocco to beat France tomorrow. It, it wouldn't really be, I mean, it'd be an upset, but it wouldn't be like an, oh my God, I can't believe that happened. I mean, the vet, France is only four to, like, they're four to one. So three and a half, about true odds are about 3.5 to one. So according to the bookmakers, if France and Morocco play each other four times, France is going to advance three times and Morocco is going to advance once. Or maybe four and one, three, about three and a half to one. Three and a half times France will go, once uh, Morocco will go. Which, uh, I mean, because you figure there's going to be games where Morocco is going to hold France score just because their defense, they park the bus and they're really good at it. And then they're good on the counter. So they basically park the bus, counter. And that you know that's what they're going to do with France. They're going to have like seven people defending and then just counter. And... If they can frustrate France and, you know, end up pushing it into overtime and then, who knows, penalties, anything can happen. The coup. gotta love what Morocco's done though I mean it's just amazing what they've accomplished they're scrappy Diago Costa 31 of 49 I don't, I don't know if England could have beat Argentina. I guess they could have on a given day, but they did play toe-to-toe -to -toe with France. I mean, they did play well enough to win, but you know, I don't know. England just doesn't seem to, I mean, they always seem to disappoint. Just uh a little bit short every time. Vela. 
Fabinho. But yeah, imagine Morocco beats Spain and uh, who did they beat? They started off beating Spain and then they beat, who did they beat in the quarters? Someone really good. Portugal, right? Yeah, Spain and then Portugal. Yeah, Spain, Portugal. So they've actually beat Spain and Portugal and then the groups too, they beat Belgium and... Uh, who is it? Canada, right? Yeah, Spain, Portugal. Yeah. Lovakovic, there's the penalty hero. Do they still play? I think they still play a third place match, right? So Croatia is going to play uh, probably Morocco. Right? Or France, if Morocco miraculously gets through. It's kind of weird. I don't know why they still have that game. That third place game is kind of silly. Okay. It's the game nobody wants to play in. Julian Alvarez. Yeah, no, it, it was tough, man. They, they won that division, like, fair and square. Everybody was like, they won the division, and then they end up getting Spain, and they, no problem, kick Spain's butt, too. No, they definitely deserve it. No, I was listening to the previews and they were talking to some of the Arab uh, stations about which Arab team you think they can make it the first. And everybody was like Morocco, 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 even before the tournament that they had high hopes. I don't think they expected this, but Mitrovic. But out of all the teams, uh, they definitely showed up. Yeah, I guess. I, I think you still get a medal, right? You get the bronze World Cup medal. Because if you finish, uh, obviously, second gets the silver World Cup medals, and there's a bronze World Cup medal for the third place team. Silver again. Yeah, Argentina lucked out. I mean, Croatia did the hard work, got rid of Brazil, played Australia. So they've had a pretty uh, relatively easy sailing. Yeah, the Dutch, that was the tough one there. I didn't know if they would make it past the Dutch, but they did, so. Julian Alvarez in England. So their one tough match was the Dutch. Purple. And Golo Kante. Come on, where are the uh, where are the inserts? It's 
Liddy, France, and Kunku. Martinez, Diaby. Yeah, I mean, they're lucky to have gotten past them after that screw up. Yeah. I mean, breakaway was sick to start. Lately, it's been a little, a little bit uh, tougher. In the last few cases, and those early cases were fire. It was like fire after fire. Van Dyke to ninety-nine. We were hitting like four or five inserts in every case. Multiple landmarks, multiple manga. Lots of color blasts, but lately it's kind of slowed down quite a bit. on purple 25 of 35 yeah the autographs have been rough too we've only hit two autos so far That's the jingle bell rock. 
That's the Jingle Bell Rock. Autograph. Hazri to ninety nine. Engraving leaf metal cards. Hmm. Honestly, I hadn't really thought about that very much. Uh you know, I don't know, honestly. Probably not. The thing is they don't have that much. It's just that uh, they just don't sell well enough to really warrant like a lot of grading. I guess it depends on who it is, but I mean, I assume you're only talking like Messi and Holland and guys like that, because otherwise the rest of them just don't warrant it. I'm not sure how well they would grade either. That part I don't know. Yeah, we did. And there really wasn't a whole lot in them, Miller. We did them earlier tonight. It was like, if you go to the very beginning of the stream, that's what we started off with. 
Only two packs left, and uh, yeah, I really didn't hit much. Out of the five packs, I think the best autos were like, or best uh, cards were like Mason Mount, and you know who it was today. Wasn't very good. Very underwhelming, yeah. Yeah, I mean, if you want to keep them on your PC, a lot of people just like to have their cards graded in their PC, which is fine. Nothing wrong with that. I would just make sure they grade well, just because, I, I mean, make sure there's nothing visible wrong with them. No, I did not see that. Sam Correa. Tell you what, the NL West is going to be uh, tough. Lotaro Martinez. The Padres and Dodgers are going to be tough, and the Giants are going to be tough. 13, I mean, the amounts, the contracts people are just throwing around nowadays are like insane. I mean, like the Padres sign and I, I mean, the amount of money they're throwing around nowadays. I mean, they're good players, but they're not like, you know. Seems like they keep one up in each other. Like the top 20, 30 players in baseball are going to be making that kind of money. Yeah, no worries, Abdul. Just let me know, man. Yeah, just let me know. Yeah, that's definitely worth grading the Pedri. Yeah. Otani too, man. Otani and Trout. In between Otani and Trout, they have probably two of like the top five players in the league in baseball. I mean, I think Otani is way better than any of these guys that are signing for three hundred million plus. At least in my opinion, Otani is a monster. He can pitch, he can hit, he can do everything. Boom, did he? Jiku. But two players do not a team make, obviously. Yeah, the the sets grade. I mean, I don't know about the Dortmund set. I know the PSG set graded really bad. Had all kinds of issues with it. Man, 
this case has sucked. I can get this going soon. The El Sucko Donkey Doodle. Doodle de Boodle. Change our luck a little, see what happens. Yeah, Altani's got to cash in big time, I would think. Uh, what do you mean by encased jersey product, uh, Kyle? I've done jersey products like the Leaf jersey product, but not, they haven't been encased. I'm actually going to set up a jersey product myself. I'm in the process of doing it right now. Or like every box is a jersey, an actual signed jersey. Yeah, we did Leaf, and I'm actually going to set one up that is going to be better than what Leaf did, I hope. Better jerseys.
Yeah, the leaf one was pretty good. It was it was actually pretty good. I gotta admit, it was pretty solid. All right, here we go. But we're gonna do one that's gonna be a lot better. Toro Martinez. To 99, Jiang, Korea. Lewandowski, Lukaku. New Era, Poland, Cameroon. USA Connections, Florian Verts. Yeah, that would be pretty cool. Gold. Gold, gold, gold. Good luck. Come on, be something good. Saudi Arabia. There's a Jonathan David. Saudi Arabia gold. Salim Al Dalsari, five of ten. Oh, sorry. Rookie Suchik, Ecuador. Ooh, there's a national pride. Boom, Diddy. Ozzy, Ozzy, Ozzy. Oi, oi, oi. Jackson Irvine, national pride. First insert of the case. Stefan Boom Diddy, Brendan Aronson, there's a Pedri. Brendan Aronson to 35, 15 of 35. What do we got there? Just the base. Forte, Mexico. Connections. Foden. There's a redemption. Autograph. Hazard. Christensen. I mean, the product that I'm talking about, Kyle, I'm actually putting together, but you can. I mean, it just depends if you shop around. Dual signature prism breakaway, La Conga and Ketelare for Belgium. Nice, Belgium. Who's got Belgium? Brian Herrera.
I want to say 650, I want to say. I think there's 650 right now. It may be adjusting them, but that's what they are currently. Jack Graylish to 99. Uh, yeah, hit me up, Kyle. I mean, I, I just, uh, depending on what you want. I The problem is I'm working on packaging. I don't have very good packaging right now. So I have probably about uh, over $100,000 in jerseys that I've bought over the years. So I do have quite a bit of jerseys. Kimmich, Kolasic. Messi. Yeah, I've been mostly I've been doing the jerseys for Jersey Palooza on the end where I, you know, for the breaks to help fill like breaks that don't fill. So rather than like discount a certain product by $300, I would add a Jersey Palooza spot that costs about $300. So, and that seemed to work, but a lot of people want to just be able to pay 300 and jump in on a Jersey Palooza. All right, here we go. Plata, gold, nine of 10. Nice. and Silva, Ecuador, got uh, Sterling, Oyarzabal, 69 of 99, Bednarek, Costa Rica, Martinelli, Zaluski, Silver, Torres, Thomas Mueller. France, Malin, Messi scores club, Wong, Richarlison, Messi global reach, New Era, Gallagher, 
Ravenberch, 32 of 49. Aketa, Japan. Cappy Goal Golasso 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 Gakpo There you go Netherlands Jeff Masson There you go Jeff came through there I'm telling you that's the lowest Netherlands has ever sold for Young Man's Son, Silver, Coutinho, Belgium, Catalare, Canada, Belgium, how about Varan, 55 of 99, that's Ozzy, 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 and Alfonso Davies. Cal, I don't really have any leaf metal left. I'm trying to get more if I can. I'm trying to get more. Benzema to 49. A lot of France in this break. Antona, Antuna, Uruguay. Connections. Bellingham and Saka. Senegal, Silver. Rookie Plata. Silva, Young and Sun, Ghana, Strony, Busio, twenty three of ninety nine for USA, Valencia, Ecuador, Ronaldo.
last time. Come on, we gotta turn this around here. Thank God for that gag for a while. Let's see what we can get. Should be getting something sexy. Huh? Oh, Cunha, Rafinha, autograph. Kellen Acosta, autograph. Dual auto was nice. Six so far. Who is that? Ferreira. Just Bellingham. Gabby. Gian. Connections, Germany. Parasic, twenty four of forty nine. Sanchez. Croatia. Rodri. Phil Foden. Julian Alvarez. Cavani. Mason Mount. New Era, Medjbri, Araujo, the 99, Dansgaard, USA,
Osmond, Correa, Pulisic and Reina, Ronaldo, Messi and Di Maria, Dybala, Japan, and that we got Cancelo, five of forty nine. We got Perisic and Morocco. We've got Canada and Aronson. Denmark, Switzerland, Serbia, Harry Kane, nice, Harry Kane to 99, and we've got rookie, Jiku, Anthony, Camavinga, Ederson, Just hit one national pride, no manga, no landmarks. Yeah, this has been a crappy case. We were pulling like two landmarks, two mangas, or like four or five of the case hits out of these, but lately it's been uh, it's been not good. Martinelli. Yes, Gakpo Auto for you there, uh, Jeff. It is a Gakpo Auto. Not numbered, but still nice. Japan, Wales. No, it's just the base, not numbered. I don't think it is. Let me check again. Pretty sure not numbered. Just the breakaway base auto. True many Denmark. Yeah, no, it is nice, definitely. The gap posts sell really well. Players of Connections, Portugal. Timber for the Netherlands, rookie to 99, Timber. Morocco, Belgium. Kane, Sar, and 
seen much Neymar yet. Kingsley Kuman, two of forty nine. Those are Doku's. Count Doku. Min Q Song, Bruno. Swell time to boin up combo. Go France again, a one horse sleigh. Giddy up, giddy up, do 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 do. Jingle around the clock. Do 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 That's the jingle bell. That's the jingle bell. That's the jingle bell rock. All right, two more boxes. We gotta do something, guys. This case has been. Uh, News Fest. Stack. Then look. Oh, crap. Saudi Arabia. Fahad Al Mawala, 20 of 35. Lasky. Reese James, Vinny Jr. Silver. Reach Darwin Nunez, two months. I think they have a chance. I think they probably have about a 20-25% chance of beating France today. Way it. They made it this far. 67 of 99. Thank you, Cal. Let's see what happens here. Let's see. If this was close enough, I'd do a filler, guys, but it just seems like uh, probably not happening tonight unless there's been a bunch of movement that I haven't seen. It's 
Stanisic, rookie. Austin's probably going to be doing that one. 24 left. Davies. Yeah, it's crazy. They're just like a brick wall, man. Nobody can get through them. Germany. All right, last box. Good luck. Let's pull this up. Manier. Autograph, Rafa Marquez, nice one there from Mexico. So no manga. Spherevic, Anthony. No manga so far and no landmark so far in this case, which is unusual for breakaway. In there, Gio Reyna, 49 of 49. Uh, shipping to the U.S. is going out tomorrow, uh, Abdul. But international shipping, it'll probably be Thursday. We were out of town this week, so just got back today. Ito and Switzerland. Martinelli, Morocco. Messi, Aronson, Alves and Silva, and Mueller. Fifty-two of ninety-nine. Garcia and Dybala. Sorry guys, that case really sucked. Okay. 
Probably, Abdul. Yeah, if you get it out, just send it to shipping at soccerbreakersfc.com. And uh, just make sure you put in there, I want UPS shipping. Uh, and uh, yeah, that should definitely do it. For international, yeah, we should be able to get it to it this week. All right, here we go on the recap, guys. Actually, you know what? Let's do the base slot first. Base slot goes to Wesley Barber. It's the best deal. It's the base slot. Welcome, Abdul. Yeah, guys, I think this is going to do it for me. Uh, we'll do a little recap here. I will... Um, or Austin will be on tomorrow. I might get on tomorrow as well. Let's just see how uh, how things go. Uh, Austin has NT now. So I'm pretty sure he has NT, so he should be able to do NT for you guys. Breakaway, he has Hobby, he has NT. Uh, if you guys feel choice, I'll get on and do choice. But anyway, I'll, just depends on what uh, Austin fills tomorrow. We'll see. If there's stuff close, I'll, I'll get on and break on myself. Uh, Argentina, that's messy combo there with Di Maria. Sure, many. Canada, that's Martinelli, Gabby, Alvarez, he's doing these, Aldo, Messi, Messi, Martinelli, Nunez, Messi, Ronaldo, Pedri, Suchik, Pedri, Luciala, Alvarez, Alvarez, Nunez, Alvarez, As, Arasquiata, Alvarez, Saka, Gavi, Canada. Oh. Pedri Gabi, give me a sec, guys. We could go five times on this. I uh, forgot I had to do this one. We're going to go five times. Five times. One, two, three, four, and five. Going to Gavi. So that one goes to Gavi. What time is it? Yeah, it's 3 a.m. I need to get some sleep. All right, number to 99. Pavlovic, Gueye, uh, Timber, Araujo, Busio, Varane, 
Oyarzabal, Graylish, Jiang, oh, that's uh, Martinez, Khazri, Van Dijk, Met Mitrovic, uh, Livakovic, Onana, Pogba, Dorami, uh, De Young, Havertz, uh, Bayron Band, Kumin, Benzema, Raven Birch, Jiku, Ukbo, Perisic, Zreina, Cancelo, Costa, Nabri, we got Conte, Valverde, Coutinho, Aronson, Griezmann, and um, wallet autos we had uh, Reese James Kellen Acosta Jose Maria Jimenez for Uruguay Mexico did well Carlos Vela for Argentina Bordiso Mexico, another nice one. Rafa Marquez autograph, Mexico. Sorry, guys, the insert sucked in this one. Only one Jackson Irvine, Australia National Landmarks. We had a Harry Kane to 99 for England. We had to 49 Alfonso Davies. Had three golds. El Dosari for Saudi Arabia, gold to 10, Plata, rookie to 10, Onana for Cameroon to 10. For Belgium, dual auto, Lokonga and Ketelare. And we did have a Gakpo autograph for the Netherlands, thank God. Something decent. Anyway, sorry guys, hopefully the next one will be better. Uh, break 10. For breakaway, WCP10 for uh, Hobby. And we also have some choice. That's the end of my choice, guys. So uh, hopefully get those choice breaks filled up. And uh, what else? That does it, guys. That does it for me tonight. And uh, 